season for new snow blowers, but make sure you're not buying a stolen one. Tonight, police in Clarence are searching for a couple bandits who made off with thousands of dollars worth of equipment. A 7 Eyewitness News reporter Ali Tui found out businesses beware because police are seeing an uptick in crime in the area. Last week, they were lined up in front of these um, bushes here. Business here at Buffalo Hescavarna got off to a rocky start. They were behind our locked gate. And we also had a large trailer um, blocking this driveway. Owner Zachary Halleck says six of his snow blowers were stolen right off the front lot. It's definitely not the best feeling in the world. And it's not as if the snow blowers vanished into thin air. Halleck says he has surveillance video that caught the thieves on camera. Video surveillance shows two men wandering around the property at approximately 855 Monday night. One at a time, the suspect moves a total of four snowblowers while the other goes to grab the getaway truck. All the while, you can see other cars driving by. I think if you're going to rob a place, you'd want to do it later at night under the cover of darkness, not at 9 p.m. when people are actually still um, driving around. But the burglary doesn't end there. Surveillance footage shows the suspects come back again to steal the remaining snowblowers, this time at 3.55 a.m. It's not uh, the fact that they stole the equipment. It's the fact that we don't know who it was and if they're going to come back. State police are investigating the incident. They say they're seeing an uptick in businesses being burglarized in the Clarence area. So they're asking owners to be on alert. To make sure that everything, your business is properly lit, your parking lots are properly lit, have cameras functioning, not just, uh, you know, mounted to the wall, but actually working. Alex glad he did. He hopes this footage helps catch the cold-hearted crooks. It looks like they're very calm and not nervous. So, you know, if you're not nervous stealing this equipment, I would say you've probably done it once before. And Halleck is offering a $250 reward for information leading to an arrest. We have his contact information right now at WKBW.com. We're live in the newsroom this evening. Allie Tui, 7 Eyewitness News.